the rumors out there about us were like really, really bad off. KKK was here, you name it, they came. My travels to learn of the people, places, and food of Kentucky take me to this place, Hillbilly Gardens. There's more to this place than the art and the clever puns, and it's a story that should be told. As a young man, Keith Holt was enthralled by the many roadside attractions that his family would visit on holiday. After a 20-year stint trying to make it in Hollywood, Keith returned to the land that has been in his family for generations to build the roadside attraction of his dreams. Long story short, Keith's neighbors wanted nothing to do with his vision. Hillbilly to me is 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 having fun because 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 the way I looked at because that was the other other thing that the county did not like is the fact I came back and started calling everything hillbilly, which they looked at me coming back being a city boy supposedly making fun of the hillbillies for. As a kid, I love the hillbilly fun places. Like someday if I had more time, you know, we'd have the man eating chicken here, you know, which of course Ooh. would be put your head in its beak and all that kind well, of stuff. Well, actually, it'd just be a man eating chicken, but. We were harassed by the neighbors. We would have the sheriff deputies call us police every other day for a noise complaint. We had child services. We had animal cruelty. You name it, they came. KKK was here. And death threats. You had people, neighbors, with uh, BB guns shooting at me while we go feed the dogs. So it wasn't a fun environment. The rumors out there about us were like really, really bad off. But once we started getting our name out there after two years of struggling to be open, we finally got open. When people start stopping, they're like, wow, what mad genius would decide to put something up like this? I'm like, well, I guess, I guess my dad and The two things I love about Kentucky, I love the scenery, and I love the old legends. What Ian might not know is that his dad is on the way to becoming one of those legends that he admires so much. The legend of the man who liked toys. And Keith from Hillbilly Gardens. Wow. <laughs> <laughs>